during the war it was important for the women to stay uh, at the job because the men were all called up. Yeah. So they were not only were they ordinary young women teaching, but all the married women who couldn't get a job uh, as married women before the war, when the war came, the married women were duly conscripted to go back to teaching to take wow. the place of the men who had been called up. If you were a teacher and you got married, you automatically lost your job. They wouldn't employ married women oh, wow. because uh, they'd be likely to have a baby in, in the middle of the year and yeah. therefore the continuity of teaching would be lost, so sort of thing. So married women just were not employed by the school board before the war. Yeah. But when the war came, of course, and all the men were called up, everything changed. Then they had to employ married women. <laughs> so whether they wanted it or not, they had no choice. There were usually only uh, there'd only usually be two men teachers on the staff. The rest would all be women. Why two? I don't know, but there were probably so that they'd be a backup for one or another. <laughs> But there were usually just two men on the staff who were teaching and uh, the rest were women.